Hello everyone, I am Jagadek and today we are going to discuss about a very cool project that I have designed recently using Monstack. The name of the project is Get It Visualized. The objective of the project is we will upload an Excel file and that Excel file will be visualized in the form of a line chart, bar chart, bubble chart, 3D surface plot and many other types of visualizations. So this project, I have used Monstack, which means MongoDB, Express.js, React.js, and Node.js. So without any further delay, going into the project, uh, the project I have did is in this folder, which has two parts, obviously client side and the server side, which we can also call as call as the front end and the back end. So I have used VS Code for this. So let me open the project. So this is the code where I have edited a lot of things. So I have used npx create react app which have created a basic react app for me and I have also used course express mongoose which I have used to connect the backend using the node. So app.js where I have put all the visualizations that I need. So as you can see here, we have whisker plot, we have box plot, and we have line graph, we have bar chart, and many other things that we need. This is done using JavaScript, and for the designing part, I have used CSS, obviously. App.css is a file where there are many things that are related to designing of the website, which we see in the later part of the video and server.js is in the server which I have used to connect the backend using node to the database that is mongodb. I have connected the client and the server using node and I have used database that is mongodb. So to run this let me open a new terminal. We need two terminals because one is to run the website that is the react app and the second is to connect to the server and to store the data to the database. First let's navigate to the client side. So now we are in the client and then going to the server. We are in the server part. Now we just have to click npm start. It starts the website. Here we have to enter node server.js which starts the server deployment server on which our website is running successfully. So as we can see here server is running on port 5000 and connected to mongodb. So the data that we are working on will be stored in the mongodb and from the mongodb the data will be pushed into the front end part where we can see the visualizations or the data that we have entered will be turned into the visualizations which you'll see in some time. So here we click npm start and the website is starting. So the name of the website is get it visualized. This is the title of the website, get it visualized. Here you can see drag and drop an Excel file here or click to select one. We haven't selected an Excel file, so we can see here no data to visualize. Upload an Excel file to get started. So once we click here or drop an Excel file, we can see the data that we can work on. So as I was already working on this project, this has redirected me into a page where I have all the CSV files. So let's take any of the excel file let's consider it as head brain so the excel file that i have selected is will be uploaded and as we can see here this is turned into the visualizations these are all the visualizations that the website have turned the data into starting with line chart we can see here this is the line chart and this visualizations are done using plotly.js so this is the first visualization line chart if you want it you can zoom in if you want you can zoom out as well 
and the second is scatter plot which is very similar to line chart but the difference is this will be plotted in the form of dots as the data is so close the dots are also so close which we can't recognize right now yes as you can see here this close the data is and this is how the data is plotted so this is scatter plot and this is bar chart based on the data the data is plotted in the form of bars designed in the form of bars and the second next one is fourth one is box plot we can zoom this in as well and we can zoom in this way also to come out we need to click zoom out these are the box plots that we have plotted from the given excel file from the given data and the next is whisker plot which is similar to bar plot box plot and the next one is bubble chart and the last and the very interesting one is 3d surface plot so from the given data it have plotted the given data in the form of 3d surface plot which means length breadth and height so this is the 3d surface plot which has all the three dimensions and the data the excel file which we have given is plotted in this format in the form of a triangle and a slope going down it is just what i was saying but the data which we have given is in this form so this has been formed and we have colors as well orange dark orange blue dark blue so these are the colors or the components or the attributes that the data has has been plotted in this way so this is the project and these are the three major files that i have edited mostly first is app.js where i have put all the things that i needed from the visualization techniques to everything and the second is app.css which i have used to design or to make up the website that i have designed already and the third is server.js which is majorly used in the parts of connecting front end to back end and back end to the database so now going to the database i have used mongodb so this is the database i have used as we can see here I have put the name of my database as database and database is created here. So opening database now we can see there are 237 documents which average document size is 95 bytes. So opening it these are the this is the data that we have in the excel file that we have given so this in this format the data is stored in the database so this is about get it visualized so this is the website which i have designed recently using monstack so this website turns the excel data excel format of data into visualizations different kind of visualization we have line chart scatter plot bar chart box plot whisker plot bubble chart and 3d surface plot so these are the visualizations that i have used and one more thing in plotly.js that i have loved a lot is we can take we can take an image of this 3d surface plot using this icon if we click on this icon the image will be downloaded as a png which we can use for the reference or for the presentation purposes so this is the website that I have created and to find the source code of it click on the github link below and to get connected click on the LinkedIn and to read more content click on the medium profile. Hope you are doing well and see you in the next video. Bye.